The fact that a little sign could go up on a on a on one of these demo pen fences say that this professional arborist has made the determination that under normal weather conditions, this tree might fall and call, cause harm to the public. It seems to me like the kind of attitude that's trying to kill the East Village, the gentrified supremacy ideology. But we're not going to get along with each other. And somebody that's a little bit dangerous seeming is going to have to be taken to the tombs. The urban experience is that we survive each other, and some of us are dangerous. There are people in the Stop Shopping Choir who are dangerous. Whoa. Amen. Whoa. But we, we might find a way to get along with you, because that's the urban experience. Is we, we, we come into our neighborhoods here, and some of us can't be trusted. And some of us are a little bit strange. And some of us are from cultures we can't immediately identify. But we come here not to be gentrified. We come here not to have the supremacy ideology, not to not to have this blank superiority that we don't have to understand. Right, we come here to be in a neighborhood, to be in a city, and there are some creative things that we can do with this elderly tree to live with it. You know, why not make it a project that we can, we can work on together so that this tree can, maybe it'll be here another five or ten years, we don't know. You're identifying the most conservative possible position. It smacks of 9-11. It smacks of fear. It smacks of gentrification. It smacks of the kinds of things that we're growing out of because we're identifying what they are. Bloomberg is no longer here. Giuliani is no longer here. And now we're changing our police force. We're teaching them how to be safer. You don't have to kill somebody you're afraid of. And we don't have to kill this tree. That's right. Life. It's a twisted tree. Yeah, it's a twisted tree. It's a tree that's making <laughs> a, a, a very individual statement. <laughs> this tree, this tree belongs in the East Village. <laughs> Who will tell the creatures it's the end of the world? Is it the end it's of the East the Village? End of the world. Is the East Village really a Super Bowl? Are the yuppies really taking over? We thought they might be Is it too late? But we sold off our most ancient power. And the spirits don't know. Bendy tree. The spirits do not know. The professionals don't have to kill you. Who will tell the spirits? The yuppies don't have to kill you.
the bendy tree. Let's let's pray to the, the anarchy, the, the danger, the the old East Village, the the ecosystem that we were attracted to when we came here from all over the world. Amen. Amen. And this seed, 150 million million years ago this seed came right here <laughs> into this Tompkins Square Park <laughs> Tompkins was barely dead and this tree showed up <laughs> and this tree has lived here and it decided to go in that one direction Amen. <laughs> it got up in the morning and it went in that direction Amen. we're not gonna second guess this decision Amen. no and these professional arborists, they might show up tomorrow morning with their chainsaws. Hey! But maybe there's something that we can do, and we're going to make a promise right now. Oh, we're praying. Yeah. We're praying for time. This is not a crime zone. <laughs> this is a glorious old life that is still alive. A danger to the public. We're not afraid of danger anymore. We know that there's death in life. And there's danger in safety. We don't want to be treated this way anymore by quote unquote professionals. Bendy Tree, we respect you. We respect you. Thank you for it. Sung in, in, in your shade for so many years. And we're so grateful.